facing Marcus Simeon. The Lone Star Series will have part two get underway with a fast. Off to get go. Marcus Simeon has hit the Astros very hard in the last. Good player, don't get me wrong. So uh, he does some good things. We just got to hold these guys down. JP. Swing and a miss at a good the Anderson strike zone. Now the count's two and two. A little bit, so hopefully we can get him right here. On the ground, third baseman is great. Kessinger tonight. Kessinger right off the mound to getting a ground ball in the first of that. Right off the mound. He pitched the last yes, inning. He didn't. Good for him. Seeger has had good numbers against G. Very, very aggressive hitter, so we got to maybe slow stuff. He normally goes after it now. Evan Carter, the batter. Carter goes after the first one and foul. Carter got off to a little bit of a slow start. The Astros, when they faced the Rangers, the career. Part of that was postseason last year when Carter really came into his own. Altuve to his left will make the play to John Singleton against the Rangers last start. Here's Adolis Garcia. And Garcia goes after the first pitch and delivers the first. In that case, it was out over the middle of the plate, made a good swing at it, and got a base hit. There's a lot of things. That hey, um, the last time I checked, the plate was 17 inches. Still is. Yeah. So I don't think that you need to use only saying they don't miss ever to the middle part of the plate. But guys don't, are not used to doing it. Over the plate. Josh Schmidt, the batter, batting in the five spot tonight. The Astros saw the range. The Astros saw him. Earlier in the year, Adolis Garcia off and running. Diaz's throw is not nine bags, leading the team with three steals already this season. Now 2-2 pitch to Smith, bounces in there and may have hit. Only played 44 minor league games and made their opening day roster. Grounds this one to third. Kessinger to his left, and the Astros get out of always ready. He's always ready. That first pitch is always one of his favorite. Tom ways to get him in. This one into right field. Adolis Garcia back, still going back, has room and puts. Jordan is amazing. He really is. He's a pleasure. Jordan hit a. Th Astros won the ball like that, that high, and not hit it out of the ballpark. It's just a click. Yeah, that ball's. An it's, it's the difference between fly balls, homers, line drives. That's what makes it so ready to hit. Yiner? Yeah. Hopefully he's uh, going to be ready to go to get back in that lineup soon. Guys, I just wanted in this field right now. He wants to see urgency from them. It could be all it takes. To and four days, and they hang right down in the corner where Julie is. We need to open Julie. Know someone in the ballpark. We need peanuts. So they're upset. <laughs> so I'm leading off, and he hits a 2-2 pitch in the right field. Kyle Tucker who hit a home run himself in the ball. about most is the day after what he feels like. Uh, and so far, so good. I'll park down in Frisco, so opportunity for a lot of things don't look good right now and everyone wants to you know say this it's this it's that and all Jared Walsh the batter with a 3-1 can be back the kitty exactly so there's a lot of things that are going to have the rest of them and I think this team is battle proven and the, the resume or who's going to be your middle relievers 3-2 pitch is a called strike better center fielder so with the injuries to Jay and they're like oh my god our middle guys are terrible that's not that's two and one the count to Leody Tavares. Little cue shot the other way. Greg Kessinger making his third play of the ball game and he makes it cleanly. Zale Tuve versus Biggio. Jordan. I'd, I'd like to write those in too. <laughs> I, would you? No. I'd, I'd like to see Jordan right handed. Right -handed. John Singleton <laughs> takes a call, third strike. So to have seen Jimmy Wynn take shots here at this stadium. Yeah, I just all right in. That's his right. In. Jeremy Pena taps one foul. What have you seen out of Jeremy? This ball instead of to go up and then down. Right back to the mound on one hop. Dane Dunning makes the play. Flips it to first for the second half. Ball club, and I just think he was so valuable. He puts the bat on the ball here on an 0-2 pitch and grounds it to second. So both a little short in the playoffs, obviously. Um, but those guys, they set the table just like any other offense, and they've done real well against us. That was part of a. They got off to a little bit of a slower start in 22 and then turned it on. A batting average, third in OPS, but we just haven't got big hits when we needed. League and run scored, led the AL in OPS. This guy was a big. 130 games, he would have won the MVP. Oh, no, he had to beat Otani, right? He had to beat Otani. 
JP walks him on four pitches. Carter's a guy we didn't see till late in the season last year. In fact, the Astros were only 21 years old. Well, he handles himself like a big leaguer. He's a great kid. So uh, looking forward to seeing more of him. And Diaz this year has gotten a lot better with this. He own. has. Yeah. yeah. He's made better swing decisions. After a first, okay. No, I, I, and it impacted the Astros this yes, year, it did. too. Yes, it did. The Astros lost both of their leads the first two games. But spent. that's happened, some of the stuff that happened during the season. That's why. That's just off. Ball four in a 1-1 game with Josh Smith at the plate. Smith takes one down for a ball. 28 to 25 balls to strike so far. The first 53 from J.P. France. Two in this inning and hit Smith his first time up. This one in particular with the bases loaded. There you go. If he wants to. Or even go back to the fastball, which is what I would do. In. Yeah. Last two batters. Now it's a full count. Bases loaded, full count pitch. Way up. Away a lot better. Because if I can lean out there the whole time. All the time. But you're the analyst for this series, so we like oh, yeah. oh, that guy's by, but it bounces right oh. back to Yiner. Ray Kessinger is first time up. The Astros could use a ground ball at somebody here. Right there. Um, I think we can get him on a breaking ball here. Uh, almost. Trying to get an out here, ground ball to try and get two would be even better. That ball is until after that ball got away from Mauricio. Fouls one. Oh. That ball hit deep to right field, and that ball is going to be gone. Jonah Heim hits one into the second deck here. And struggles continue for the Astros. They had Eddie in two thirds of an up. inning out of Hunter Brown. So this bullpen has. And our bullpen didn't go. Now, obviously, in the beginning, this ball hit pretty well, but Jake looks like he has it lined up. Seth Martinez is. I mean, 